been going around uh, trying to find out how how else can government be able to help them uh, not only in the materials that they want to weave but also in the techniques in the looms in the colors in the designs in the in the sizes because that's what we in the government uh, must do uh, particularly at the department of science and technology so we are heavily into innovation in the science and technology and uh, the textile outputs of these countries is really really very uh, inspiring and, and promising The 2023 National Arts and Crafts Fair. This year's fair is a special one as it marks the return of this beloved event to its physical format after a three-year hiatus. It is truly a celebration of the resilience and creativity of our Filipino arts and crafts industry. As we gather for the 2023 National Arts and Crafts Fair, an avenue for us to celebrate the rich tapestry of our nation's artistic heritage. The National Arts and Crafts Fair has returned to this national stage today. The heart of the Philippines, where diverse cultures converge and traditions thrive, we find a unique and profound expression of artistry passed down from generation to generation. Going back to our homeland, really looking back, ano ba yung kultura natin? And hindi naman siya modernization, kundi para bang um, reinventing, innovating, kung ano yung nakaraan to be appreciated in the present. Welcome to all the 240 micro, small, and medium enterprises present here. They are carefully curated. Number one, you must be community-based. Number two, you must be community-managed. Number three, fair trade. Number four, ethical trade. Number five, sustainable rural livelihoods. So having said that, I would like to welcome all of you. This National Arts and Crafts Fair is really a collaboration, a convergence of all the MSME programs of government with the Department of Trade and Industry and the NTCA as the lead agency, but all the others have their presence here. The problem with local uh, businesses is that we don't have access to them. They are doing very good things, very nice products, but seldom do we see them in mainstream market. They've not, you know, the mainstream market has not been very kind to uh, up-and-coming entrepreneurs, and this platform is a very uh, it's a very appropriate platform for them not only to come and show their work but also to mingle with other artisans so I think it's a it's a it's a very uh, it's a very progressive way of looking at businesses